Folks, if you follow One Rental at a Time in the Daily Financial News, you know today, uh, April 6th, we talked about the, the average mortgage rate being at 6.16. We talked about homeowners getting rates in the fives and actually had a couple of people talk about five and a half. Well, I got the boys from Convoy and they are telling me you can get something with a four handle on it. What are you guys talking about? Jonathan, Dustin, you guys got to be crazy. What do you mean four handle? What, what are we talking about? The market's been nuts. Obviously, I mean, no one really knows what no one ever knows what's going on, right? But um, you know, the the 10-year treasury this today has dropped uh pretty significantly and I, and you know, right now it's done a pretty big dip down just overall in the last I think week, you know. So, um oh, yeah. yeah, I, I everyone's kind of chasing to see where it's going to go. Non-Q has hasn't moved like that much in terms of rate-wise, but conventional obviously being more volatile on a daily basis has moved um pretty significantly and we were we were actually doing some uh some quotes for people and i think that if right now if if you can qualify full doc um on a conventional loan and you don't mind closing in your personal name and all the other stuff i mean you might as well um yeah. the only caveat with conventional is the uh the cash out if you're doing a conventional loan it's like you know 12 months of seasoning now for the cash yeah. out but you know, other than that, I mean, right now is a great time. You might be able to get rates that were available maybe like mid last year, you know? Yeah. So I think Dustin, so, what was it, what was it you were quoting out today? Well, I mean, literally this morning on owner rock stuff, like Mike said, um, you can pay like two points, you know, perfect credit, 20% yeah. down on a purchase owner occupied, like 4.8. Like I, I was just what? like, it, it's weird to see a four number uh of, of, of four that starts the yeah <laughs> yeah the first number is a four yeah and then you know john was pricing one out this morning too on an investment property four unit i think you said was like at five eight yeah going conventional yeah with a couple with i think a point and a half or something yeah. which i mean five yeah. eight year fixed you know if you could put 25 percent down that's a no-brainer yeah. So folks, if you haven't added convoy home loans to your Rolodex, you need to do that today. Reach out to them, go to their website, tell them you came from ORAD. Uh, again, they come on, they talk about non-QM, they talk about DSCR loans, but they also do conventional stuff. So I want to repeat what I heard just so there's no confusion. So first we'll talk owner-occupant. So owner-occupant, full doc, no exceptions, right? In your name, 20% down, 25% credit, I don't know, 780 and above. You with a couple of points, you could get something with a four on it today. Is that what I heard? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. I am I am so afraid for the housing market. Yeah, that's the problem, right? That exactly. A it's all demand. We don't need more demand. There's no supply. Yeah. This is going to make it worse. And I'm like, exactly. Oh my God. So I, this is a question I've never asked anybody. And if you don't, you probably don't have the data in front of you, but use your experience. When you look at all the applications that come across your desk, what percent are 780 and above? Just a ballpark guess 20%, 30, 10. What do you, what, what would you wildly guess? yeah it's less yeah. there's there's no i mean 780 and above is very rare yeah okay all right so what yeah. what is what's considered best is 780 or 760 maybe i'm using the wrong number what's the best credit usually some lenders are set at 740 and you're great that's it some are okay. at you know 800 right oh, okay like, so there's so so 780 is rare yeah i don't know rare so I, single I, digits I'd say the most common borrow we have is probably 700 to 720. Yeah. Okay, so that helps. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But I mean, obviously, the, the higher the FICO, the better. A lot of people yeah, of think course. that FICO is always better than it actually is, right? Typically, um, that we yeah. see, right? So, yeah. um, I, I mean, they're, they're talking about changing that scoring model. So, we'll, I'm interested to see how that rolls out. But until then, it's supposed to make credit, like, better, you know, increase. Right. So, right. you know, we'll see what happens. But... Like you said, there's no supply, a lot of demand. Uh, and yeah, I mean, if we're what, uh, five and a half, it, dude, five and a half is the worst rate. If we yeah. get the average borrow at five and a half, demand's going to explode. Supply is going to be, it's, it's going to yeah. be bananas again. Yeah, I, be I'm bad. already seeing prices go up. Like I just quoted one out for a client here in LA in, in, uh, 
Long Beach and he was buying his primary residence. It's a jumbo loan though, but um, it was listed at one, two, nine. It's already going at one, four, five. The agent basically said, don't, don't submit anything at one, four, five or, or, or below. It's like, it's just not even going, it's probably going to end up at one, five. So uh, 1.5 million for, yeah. you know, yeah. yeah. So LA, right. So um, just wild. It's, it's crazy. Like prices, you know, one, two, it was well, let's say one, two, nine, it's going at one, five. Like there's no inventory. So everyone's bidding for the same thing. Rates came down a little bit. So now people are flooding to that, pro that property. Um, and what's crazy is the appraisal is probably going to come low because I, I just did one in LA too, is a fourplex. It was listed at one, two. And it, in Lawndale, it was 1.2 million. I got the appraisal back at 1.0. And then we had to get basically three appraisals to get it, get an appraiser that would value it at 1.2. Wow. So it, it's like the market is not, it's not supporting the increased, you know, demand. It's, it, this is on. just, this is going to be bad guys. It's going to be bad. We've got no inventory. I, I went on the daily financial news this morning and ranted. If we got to five and a half, this entry level home is going to just be bananas. We're going to have acceleration clause and bidding wars and, yeah, it's it's gonna be it's gonna be back to where we were. And um, what even scary now? I mean, I didn't know about the four, but um, because I didn't check that this morning. But if, like for example, you do like a temporary buy down, sellers want to pay or something, you're you're going yeah. two to one in the in the twos. You're buying yeah. the first you're in the twos, which is crazy. It's good for people if you can find a good deal, a great yeah. deal, great deal. Then yeah. by all means, yeah. but for everyone else that's gonna be up bidding, that's gonna be a problem. So then let's, again, that was, that was owner rock, which freaks me out, yeah. but now we even have investors getting loans in the fives. Did you say five, eight? So again, good credit, full down seasoned property has reserves, you know, kind of, kind of the box, right? They can get something in the fives today. Conventional. Yeah. 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 Five, five, eight, seven, five on a four unit. That was actually, I mean, it's LA. So, you know, that was like, it was listed at two five but you know with 25 down it was like within the 1.89 jumbo limit for la but yeah. like five eight you know that's yeah. how when when have we seen that in the conventional world in the last basically nine months year. yeah almost, almost a year, year. Yeah. yeah always almost been a year i mean you know when we first came on the show we were talking about threes and fours you know I and remember we rapidly talking about four, five, six, seven, eight. We were talking at nines at one point, right? Yeah, we and, did. I remember that. What happened? Yeah, and, and now we're back at five, eight. It's kind of like, you know, it's kind of crazy. Obviously there, there's a cost associated to it, right? Sure. So people can't call and be like, yeah. hey, I want that five, eight right now. There's cost associated to it. But yeah. um, either way, it's like the fact that you can even get there. I mean, if you can lock it in and find a great deal, again, great Done. deal. Yeah. Do it, right? Yeah, it, exactly. Never need a refi. Just keep it. And then if it comes down later to a three, then refi. But until then, like, you know, whatever. 30-year yeah. yeah. money, folks. If you're not getting 30-year money today, no arms, no arms, no arms. But guys, if you haven't added Convoy Home Loans to your Rolodex of lenders to talk to, please do it. Go online, convoyhomeloans.com. Tell them you came from ORAT. The beauty of that is you will get Jonathan or Dustin. Uh, if you don't do that, you're just going to get somebody else. You want one of these two guys. And by the way, you guys just get great feedback from the One Rental at a Time family. They're tagging me on Instagram and other things. So thank you for all you do. Thank, thank you. you.